Believers devotedly venerating and praying at this statue of St. Noah Mawagadi, which stands before the Chinda Mitiana Cathedral and pins the respect of a martyr who chose a dignified death over life. Every 31st May, pilgrims make a journey to this holy site to remember St. Noah. I come here to pray in a special way because wherever, whenever I come here, I get what I have prayed for. Today has been exceptional. Previously, pilgrims came from Chinda Mitiana Diocese, but today's pilgrimage attracted faithfuls from five dioceses Kampala, Kasana Luero, Masaka, Lugazi, and Chinda Mitiana that form the Kampala Ecclesiastical Province. <laughs> Four bishops, including Emmanuel Cardinal Wamala, Bishop Paul Semogedede of Kasanaluero, Bishop Kagwa of Masaka Diocese, and Bishop Anthony Ziwa, the host, graced the occasion. <laughs> bishop Cyprian Chizitorwanga and Bishop Christopher Kakoza were represented by their vicar generals. The Bishop of China, Mitiana, Anthony Ziwa, led the Eucharistic celebration. <laughs> In his homily, Bishop Zua described Noah Mawagali as a man of valor who stood by Christ even when he stared death. On reaching here, where the Christians had settled, of course some ran away, but no, Mawagali came out, but he asked them, what did you want, Mawagalachi? And they told him that they were looking for Christians. And he responded with these Uganda words, this Uganda word, Tutuno, and they speared him. At this very spot, Saint Noah Mawagali was martyred. He witnessed to Christ by being speared and shedding his blood. Now, this was the home of Saint Luca Banabachintu, another martyr, where Christians used to gather to pray. Saint Matia Mulumba, another martyr, was also one of those Christians. Chinda Mitiana is also the birthplace of St. Ambrose Chibuka. Bishop Zua encouraged pilgrims to emulate St. Noah so as to fight the social evils that the country is grappling with. So we have no excuse to succumb to some of these challenges. Let us keep those words of Noah Mwagali to know here we are Christians to bear witness to Christ in our words and in all what we do. This year's pilgrimage to this site comes at a time the Catholic Church is marking the Feast of the Holy Trinity. Bishop Zewa called upon Christians to be united. Is there be unity in the family? Is there be unity in our small Christian communities? Is there be unity in our parishes? Also present were pilgrims from Nigeria, the Knights of St. Charles Luanga. Gertrude Tumusime with Kwari, NTV, Mitiana.